How's it going guys? Lucian Sword here, playing some more Brawlhalla for you guys today, as always, and it is a very special day today, because we have a brand new legend, Onyx the Gargoyle, released and playable. We are going to play Onyx, even though they just basically unveiled Onyx yesterday, she is already in the game that fast. And yes, it is a she. Even though it's like a stone gargoyle, I guess it has a gender. So anyways, if we're looking at the news here, also the luck of the brawl event starts tomorrow and it has a new skin and everything. So we'll be going over that in tomorrow's video. But today is Onyx's day to shine. So hyped for this, guys. So there you go. That's Onyx. There's her stats. She's got five strength, four dex. Eight defense, woof, makes sense, you know, she's made out of stone. And then five speed. She has gauntlets and cannon, which, that's a pretty cool combo. Those are her three skins so far. I like all three of them, but these two are probably my uh, favorites. I really like the Guardian Onyx, but to, uh, I'll, be, I'll be honest, the base skin for Onyx actually looks really good. Like, it doesn't look bad at all. This skin, I don't know, man. It, it's kind of, I don't know. Something about it is not the best, but you know how we do it here. I'm gonna get all of them anyways. Let's go ahead and do it. Project Onyx. We're gonna look at the different colors for each skin really quick. Not gonna take too long in that. And then we're gonna play some 1v1 games. So I'm gonna use every single skin here at least once. Oh, that one looks amazing. Alright, we got all of her skins. Let's go ahead and jump into a lobby really quick. We can look... Actually, no, let's go into uh, training so we can actually look at the colors. So, here's the base skin. I'm just going to cycle through the colors that people care about the most, which is basically white, black, Skyforge, Goldforge, community colors. Actually, you know what's missing is all the holiday colors. That's too bad. You, you would think in training you could at least see all the holiday colors. And here we have Soulbound Onyx. This is looking really good. I like this uh, design a lot. Wow, Community Colors looks really good. Goldforge, Skyforge, both look good as always. This looks amazing. I can't wait to get level 25 Onyx and get the black colors. Uh, white as always is too much white. No, no accent color. Again, missed opportunity there. Um, I'll go quickly. Actually, gray looks really good. I'm gonna go quickly through the rest of the colors. Let's look at Guardian Onyx. This one's probably everybody's favorite, I'm guessing. Is that like a little Dragon Ball on the cannon almost? That's what it looks like, especially on Community Colors, kind of. Oh, man. Ah, uh, of course. Black looks so good. Actually doesn't look terrible. What do you guys think is the best color? That actually looks pretty good, too. Cyan, Cyan looks good on a lot of skins. So does Brown. And last but not least, Project Onyx. This one looks like it was designed by a nine-year-old to me. Like it looks like a Nerf gun legend. I don't. I don't know. The the CCs don't look that great on it compared to the other skins. That looks pretty crazy. Yeah. Ah, oh, black for sure looks the best on that one. I think very clean. And we're gonna quickly look at the rest of these for you guys. Before we jump into a uh, actual game, though. Let's go into Meet the Legends really quick. I know you guys are probably getting antsy for some gameplay, and we'll get there. Where is he? What is this? Alphabetical? Okay. Uh, so, there's the lore. I'm not going to read it to you guys. I already did read it, so I'll just summarize it really quick for you. Basically, she was like in this infernal realm, battling like demons and stuff. She finally escaped the infer infernal realm, and in order to not go back, she like bound herself to some castle, Castle Batavia. And she protected that castle for hundreds of years. Eventually, uh, the castle fell because she uh, didn't want to defend it against a mad king anymore. And she knew if she left the castle that she'd have to go back into the Infernal Realm. And it was basically seen as a sacrifice. So because of her sacrifice, right before the demons came and got her after the castle fell a Valkyrie appeared and basically swooped down and rescued Onyx and offered Onyx a place in Valhalla. 
and now she guards Valhalla. So there you go. Career usage, zero. Um, I've only played Onyx in training. So you guys are about to witness my very first game in 1v1 with Onyx. I'm going to do a game with each uh, skin. So I'm going to start it out with default skin, default colors. We'll go over the moves as I play. Uh, so you guys can actually see what they look like in a real game. All right, while we wait, uh, cannon neutral sig looks like that. Basically, you just shoot a huge blast of blue smoke up in the air. Very cool neutral sig. I like it. It comes out fast. Seems like it's not that easy to punish. Oh, they actually updated this map to look beautiful. Although I will say it looks a little too washed out. Like too much, too much. I don't know what the artistic term is, but it's too blurry. Just testing out some of these SIGs! That's a, the, uh, the down SIG on the cannon is where she does the, uh, the rock form and it hits all directions. So it's so good. Look at that. Uh oh. There you go, boys. Got that side sig. So, gauntlets, man. This is going to be fun. That's the side sig that he did there and I did. I'm not dead yet. Neutral sig is really fun. That's a down sig. It's a very good edge guard move. If they pop their head over the edge, you could just, boom, hit him with that down sig. I don't remember all her moves because obviously I'm just playing her for the first time so I'm probably doing a bad job, but man, she is fun. And the neutral, oh, I missed it. Ooh, I forgot about that side sig on gauntlets. That's actually probably her best move. Alright, so the neutral sig does have a lot of recovery frames. So be careful doing it, I guess. It didn't it didn't recover as quickly as I thought it would. Man, the down sig you could really spam. It's very spammable because of the fact that it hits every direction. Even if it's a short range, you know what I mean? Look at that. I could hit that. I probably hit the down sig more than any other move. Ooh, nice ground pound. I thought I could hit him with that cannon recovery, but I guess not. Oh. I wish I would have hit the side stick at least once. It's like a better version of Bryn's uh, down stick on Axe. Uh oh. I would love if I could hit the uh, neutral sig. Neither of us have hit the uh, neutral sig on either mo on either weapon. That entire game, neither of us hit the neutral sig on either weapon. That's crazy. All right, so next game I'm for sure going to try. Look at how weird she's chugging that game fuel, man. That's, that's interesting. All right, there was base default Onyx. Let's go ahead and try Soulbound. Oh, man, this looks so good. First game with Onyx is a win, though it was close and I was sig spamming. You're going to see a lot of sig spamming, so don't get, like, all bent up, out of shape about it. Everybody's trying to learn the new legend. 
It's okay to six spam when you're learning. I mean, I wouldn't six, you know, true six spam is when you're only doing nothing but six. And that's not what we're trying to do here. We're just trying to find out some weapon combos like light attacks into six, see what works. I haven't really messed around in training too much, so. Come on, dude, why aren't you playing Onyx? I'm just joking, not everybody can uh, get all the legends right when they come out. I want to hit that neutral six so badly. There it is! No, 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 where are you going, dude? I don't know if he waved to me like on accident or on purpose. I'll give him a salute. You wanna play this game rolling? Oh, he does. Woo! That was a nice weapon throw. Oh, not the home run! Woo! Oh, nice one, dude. I'm dead. I'm surprised I didn't kind of hit him with that neutral sig, but... Oh, well. Tragic. That neutral sig on gauntlets, man, that's hard to hit. I will hit it once! <laughs> I just want to hit it once. That's so hard to hit, dude. Why is it so hard to hit the neutral sig? one dude wasn't expecting that quick side air oh there's a side stick for the finisher baby that's what I'm talking about GG tragic GG why is it not letting me go next I'm spamming a right now the game is glitching okay there we go all right we got Guardian Onyx. Oh, this one looks so good in Community Colors. Oh, I'll do default. I normally never do default colors except on like the day the legend comes out. Nothing against them. I just I just love all the other colors usually. Um, I will say that I still need to hit the gauntlet neutral say guys. I haven't even landed it Three, once. Two, one. Let alone for the kill. Alright, Pro Hunter. Let's go. I got a feeling this person has never seen Onyx 6 because... Man, that move is amazing. The down sig, I mean the side sig, it's basically Brin's axe down sig, but good. It comes out fast. All right, Orb is absolutely destroying me right now. What? Come on, man. Alright, note to self. She doesn't dodge up. Neutral sig. That's what I'm talking about.
did not hit her with that. Oh my gosh, that was a beautiful down air, dude. Oh my goodness. This guy really is a pro. Bro is insane on the on the uh, orb, but that's okay. I think I'm better with the gauntlets than the than the cannon. insane Dude, close fight. Oh. Oh, what? How did that hit me, dude? Wait, GG, though. GG. Oh, man. Alright, I think we have one more skin to go through, guys. That was a good game, Pro Hunter. Mm. Last but not least, guys, Project Onyx. Let's do it. Last but not least. And then I'll give my final impressions on the legend. Or at least my initial final impressions. <laughs> Going against Vizk. Vizik? Vizkix? Vizk. <laughs> He's using the CC colors because they look so good. Uh, the tail smack on the gauntlet downstick is pretty cool. Alright, good gauntlets, good gauntlets. Nice one. How did I not get him with that recup that uh, neutral air though? Oh well. Ooh, got him with the cannon, man. Boom.
Yeah, boy. Oh! Bye-bye. I like the uh, side sig just because of how much distance it covers. GG, dude, GG. That was like my best game. Two stock? I'll take it. Alright, so final initial... <laughs> I love the, the deal with it shades on my dude. Uh, GG, dude, GG. Final initial impressions of Onyx. Um... It's definitely a high defense character, and what I mean by that is like, for example, Queen Nye is another uh, one. Uh, kind of reminds me of a slower moving uh, Vector. Very, it, it's almost like Vector's cousin, because I don't know if it's just because of the big bulky body that Onyx has, uh, but the... Hmm, what am I... The gauntlets are good. Let's start with that. Gauntlets are good. The SIGs are okay. The one thing I don't like that much, the Gauntlet Down SIG is amazing. It comes out pretty fast, and it actually hits them really hard uh, to the side, which is good for killing. Uh, but the Cannon Side SIG is almost the same exact move. Like, he smacks his tail down, and then he hits him with the Cannon. It's literally almost the exact same move. So I would like to see a little more variety in the SIGs, but other than that, he seems good. The Gauntlet Neutral SIG is incredibly hard to hit, but I, I imagine with the practice and if you just really know when to go for it, you know, but for the most part, you probably won't use it very often. Um, overall, I think it's a fun new legend, you know. We have, a, we have, hopefully this is the last cannon legend we'll get and then we'll get a new weapon. That's what I'm hoping. New weapon next. Let me let me know what you guys thought of this legend in the comments. I'm interested to know. I do read all the comments, and I will be posting uh, some community colors codes after the video premieres as well. And next time you guys see me playing Onyx, I will definitely be using colors as well because I I did base skin and all these, so I don't have any colors unlocked. I'm gonna have to level up my Onyx, and we'll work on that. The first uh, holiday color that we're going to be able to get for him is tomorrow, which is the Lucky Clover colors. If you guys don't remember what those look like, there you go. So we're going to get the Lucky Clover colors for Onyx. That should look pretty cool. And then it'll be on to what? Heat Wave? And we'll get Heat Wave for Onyx after that. And so on and so forth. So anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like. And I hope to see you in the next one. This is Lucian Sword. Take it easy, guys.